what's up guys today we are going to learn nucleophilic substitution reactions in my previous lecture i discussed about nucleophile and electrophile if you miss that that lecture then you can you can <coughs> watch that lecture uh, in the playlist so let's get started what is nucleophilic substitute substitution reaction if you divide this topic then you are getting two part one is nucleophilic and another is substitution uh, reaction so uh, this uh, substitution reaction uh, will happen uh, will be happened by a nucleophile and have a look here this is substrate right and nucleophile is attack attacking uh, sub substrate you, you know uh, nucleophile or all nucleophile has one pair of uh, uh, electron uh, and that that is the cost uh, uh, to be uh, to be risk uh, risk molecular species however uh, in substrate uh, here L is a living group and uh, if nucleophile attack the substrate then living group a L will be uh, replaced by nucleophile and we are getting uh, substituted compound uh, this and this is a living group and a question <coughs> may arise in your mind that what is substrate substrate uh, is that kind of uh, compound that is attracted by nucleophile on the other hand uh, nucleophile uh, uh, nucleophile replace uh, replace a, a uh, atom or group of atom from substrate and the replacing atom or group of atom is called uh, living group right so now you can make definition uh, of the substrate and of the living group and also you are able to make uh, definition of the nucleophilic substitution reaction so nucleophilic substitution reaction is a one kind of substitution reaction in which uh, living group from substrate is replaced by a nucleophile so here are here are e is alkyl group so this alkyl group may be methyl group or ethyl group, right? And already I have told you the answer of these two questions, what is living group and what is substrate. If you want to uh, watch a specific example, then you have to watch this. Here, CH2, CH2O, a, a benzene molecule. Here, this is alkyl group, right? and this is living group when you are adding adding sodium iodide then this chloride will be replaced by uh, iodide so you are getting uh, this substituted compound and sodium chloride so this is a nucleophilic uh, substituted nucleophilic substitute substitution reaction i hope believe and expect that you all have understood these things clearly and thank you for viewing this video if you think that this video is helpful for you you can subscribe the channel to get a notification of a new video be well